Hey guys, what is up? It's Neiman, and there's a lot of people on the highway. I'm sorry, I can't control that. But I have good news, and that is the fact that today we are finally going to be watching Rainbow Dash Presents My Little Dashy, I believe that is what it is called. Yeah, okay. They didn't like change the title or anything. Alright, well. I'm pulling up the episode now because I am crazy excited. And yeah, I was right. This one, I expected it as much, is going to be like super crazy long. It's nearly half an hour, um, which is a lot longer than the other episodes that I have watched by at least uh, five, ten minutes or so. So um, I'm not going to talk much, uh, at least not in the beginning like I usually would do where I babble and it really has nothing to do with the actual video. But I will say um, that fatigue that I mentioned uh, in my last update video, it's very real and it's happening right now and that kind of sucks. So I might, believe it or not, be a little tired um, as you guys can probably already tell by my voice. I don't know if I sound tired or not because it's me. Um, but yeah, whatever. If I do, I apologize. I want you guys to know that I am actually really excited to watch this video. A lot of you guys have been really excited as well, and that's gotten me really pumped. And I, obviously, to no one's surprise what to, whatsoever, um, I have already read the fan fiction of My Little Dashi. I cried significantly. Um, you know, as much as a person like me can cry with the book, or I guess fan fiction. Um, you know, but I, I don't think, obviously they change it up a lot, so, when it comes to these videos, so I don't think I'm gonna cry, but I do think I am going to laugh my ass off, and that's, that's just as good, at least to me it is, if anything it's kind of better, but, yeah, um, that's, that's about it, I, I do, I guess I, uh, I can say it now and get it over with, because I might actually forget at the end, I want to apologize for making some of you guys worry um with my last update video i kind of gave off the impression that i am kind of slowly sleeping slip sleeping slipping back into my little funks as i like to call them no this feels very different it's just i'm just so tired and that's pretty much it i i'm just trying so hard just to figure out what i can do and it's it's a little exhausting and my friend Matthew at the moment doesn't really want to talk because he's busy because Pokemon Go is a thing and that makes me kind of feel bad because my phone is broken and I'm kind of in the middle of getting a new one and that's also really expensive and that that that's a thing and <laughs> so yeah yeah just a, a bunch of stuff happening all at once some stuff that you guys don't know about and I apologize but uh, I'm fine I am I'm just I'm just trying to figure things out, and that's about it. So, okay, so I'm going to stop talking, because I believe I've been talking for a while, roughly 3 minutes, 30 seconds. So, I'm going to go ahead and start. So, 3, 2, 1, go. The Rainbow Dash presents My Little Dashy. Nice. It looks really good. Like... Harry Wayne lived his life like any normal monkey, one day at a time, oh. experiencing one event after the next, or okay, maybe then. every event all at once, depending oh, on how right. you think about uh, it. This but he just thinks use... he's experiencing one event at a time. Uh, you know, or, anyway, uh, no time travel or anything for the most part, except for forwards, which is kind of too bad because that would be fun. Aww. But fun is not something that Harry is really good at having. He's more good at being angry at the city and vigilant against its shortcomings. It's Batman. become a routine since the death of his parents that he spends Batman. each night traveling the streets, ridding it of the wrongs that caused those deaths in the first place. He spends a lot of time staring at a pretty supercomputer, <laughs> mostly super because of sentimental reasons, Aww. and it's freaking bad for his eyes. Oh. And so his routine remained, until one day when hanging an innocent man on a light pole for a crime he could have committed but actually didn't, Harry Wayne Aww. spotted a box, and that box would well, change then. his life forever. Oh, uh, yeah, okay. Oh. Who on earth leaves trash just laying around in the street? I swear people only think of themselves. Well, I guess it's up to me to deal with yet another one of the city's... 
It's freaking Rainbow Dash. Aww. Not just Rainbow Dash, but baby Rainbow Dash. That's the cutest, most potential-filled, most stark, naked kind of Rainbow Dash there is. <laughs> Harry's dried and crusty heart cannot help but melt into a crusty soup. She's Ew. so adorable. Ooh. Ooh. Now who on earth would throw away a perfectly good magic pony? Harry immediately does what just about anybody would do in this kind of situation. He stuffs me down his yep. shirt and runs <laughs> off. That's what I would do. Uh, now, contrary to what most ponies think, being a bat is very expensive. So even yeah. though Harry has paid off all the debts on his bat car, and his bat lube, and oh. his bat pewter, that stuff costs millions, which was all of his inheritance so he doesn't have money for a bat house. Just a normal house his in a really bad part of town. Thing is, um, so that's where he takes baby me. Blocks. In fact, Harry Wayne actually has no real income at all, so everything except his bat stuff is pretty rough. Run down, and the bat car is gonna be on cinder blocks until yep. he can bum a few hundred dollars off someone. As we enter the house, Harry stops to rub his little monkey fingers all over a picture of his parents. Aww. Hello, mom and dad. They're um dead. The they died fighting a horrible this. Lord Wizard Spirey or something. Oh, really. oh, oh baby, right so, um, When that awkwardness is over, he dumps me on the floor and lets me get to exploring. In the assumption that I'll be pretty darn cute. Yeah, of course, this house is pretty cold, so the first thing I do is pee. Oh. It's kind of like the main thing that babies do. Yep, After that, he feeds me carrots, which I'm just old enough for, and it makes us instant friends. My parents would have flipped out if they'd known I'd gotten a whole carrot at this age. They'd be huh. all like, eat your mutt. Oh. Alfalfa, it's good for you, but not Harry Wayne. Well, I don't know what horses eat, but you're a magical horse, so I'm sure it'll work out. Yep. Oh, and by the Logic. way, the feeder hasn't worked since my father died. You're going to be so happy here. Okay. And I stay for months. I learn to talk pretty quickly, but I never get to go outside, and I think it's seriously stunting my emotional growth because I just destroy everything in my youthful rebellion. Well then. Gorilla Dash? Lunch. What are you doing up there? I am playing. Playing what? It's too noisy. I am playing run. I'm running. Well, no more play and run. You can play sit instead. Uh, I hate sit. Sit is so a nice game. Adorable. You love sit. Kids today don't have enough imagination. What are you going to do with basic cable, the internet, or Xbox that you can't do? Big girls don't cry, Dashie. Harry is best parent. Big girls don't cry. See? <laughs> Hey, hey, Dashie, look, look, I have a sugar cube. If you play sit, you'll get a sugar cube. Oh, okay, yes, gimme, give gimme give the cube. Do you like sit? Yes. Do you like sit? Yes, I like the cube. Let me hear you say you <laughs> like sit. Okay, I love it, I love sit. Now give this sugar cube. Oh, that's so adorable. Precious. Now you be good. Daddy has to go to wizard school, and he'll be back for dinner. Okay, and then. Whatever you do, don't oh, go outside. Harry. Oh, why didn't I think of that? <laughs> I should no have figured that out No can now. withstand Rainbow Dash. Hey, Barbara. Where you gonna get them nice shoes, girl? What's they that? match y'all's pink earrings. Oh, hey, Sven. I done got these at the Rich Monkey Store, where they sell one underwear at a time. Oh, wow. Well. <laughs> Hello? Hi. Uh, my name is Rainbow Dash. I'm breaking the rules. Nice. Don't tell anybody. Oh my gosh. Is y'all a magical pony? Yes. No, Why does nobody regular. freak out? Regular, but you're talking in blue. That's not regular. You've got to be magical. Yeah, okay. Uh, that's awesome. Uh, I didn't know other ponies, so I, I couldn't compare. My name is LaFonda. LaFonda de la Ronda Bafanya. But y'all can call me LaFonda. Okay. okay. My first wish is to be a princess. Oh, that's a good wish. I, I wish that too. I thought you granted wishes. Uh, oh, um, no. Oh, I, feel like I, that I don't know how to do that. Well, how come? You lost from a leprechaun village or something? <laughs> <laughs> no, I live here. Okay, well, does y'all want to play Barbara's with me? Sure. Okay, then. You be Barbara, and I'll be Sven. Wow, girl. Them sure is some sexy shoes. They make you look damn fine sexy, girl. Oh. Nice. <laughs> oh, gosh. I never played with I, dogs. I don't know what that means for sure, but, but thank you so much. Places. Wow, have y'all played Barbara's before? You're pretty good at it. This Thank is my you, first LaFonda. time. Thank you. Uh, I don't know why my dad won't let me LaFonda go outside. Nice. I'm having I like a really LaFonda. nice time. I don't have no dad. My mama says she don't need no man. Yeah. Hey, y'all's a bony. You want some sugar cubes? Yes. Seriously? Uh, I always want sugar why cubes. Why do you have just you a have random jar of sugar cubes? Oh my gosh, cubes. being outside is like the best thing ever. Here y'all do. Oh my gosh. Thank you. For a second there, I thought she was going to get stuck in the fence. <laughs> wow. So amazing. The most incredible monkey ever. Aww. What are y'all doing? I don't want this. Are you kidding? I have to give you something in return. 
Uh oh. Oh. Oh no, my dad came home. Well, bye. <laughs> right then, I realized that if I went through that door, my monkey dad would see me and know for sure I broke the rules. Wow, it sure is lucky I left this book sitting here. Otherwise, I'd have had to search the whole house. Rainbow Dash, were you outside? No. I broke the rules. Oh. I am a rebel. Sweetheart, it is very important that I don't you. have any scruples. Listen to me, Dashy. You can't go outside because if you do, the government will find you and then they'll cut you into pieces. Jesus. <laughs> oh, no. Why would they do that? I don't know. It's just what the government does. Well, okay they then. find some rare, one-of-a-kind animal. And then they just cut it up into pieces for science. Even if I ask them not to? Especially if you ask them not to. Okay, That'll just make then. them angry. Trust me, little Dashie. There is no better place for you than here with me. But if you want, tomorrow I can stuff you down my shirt and we can go to the park. Okay. That's a good girl. Would you like a sugar cube? I still don't... Uh, would I? Yes, please. You know, and you're so life continued, fat. with me falling into a terrible and boring routine with no Aww. real aspirations. The only link between me and the outside world and sanity was the Fonda. We're so lucky we found each other. Okay, I haven't been this happy since creepy. before my parents died. I'm being squished. Can I please have my own room? You're not ready yet. Day after day, I'm no. a diet of nothing but carrots, I'm sugar cubes, Harry. and whatever else the Fonda would feed me. Just hanging around, fighting the power, and then getting the power explained to me again. The only breaks <laughs> were the weekly colic episodes that turn hours into years. Jesus. But worst of all was when my dad decided that I liked NASCAR on DVD. Because I, I really obviously like oh, the you idea have of done racing. That. It looked like a lot of fun to ride in a race car because they go so fast. But Ooh. sitting around just watching race cars go in circles for hours and having my monkey dad skip past the accidents was way boring. Wow. When I turned old enough, monkey dad decided uh, I was ready for a job. Which Rainbow is super has lame. gotten Of fed. course, I couldn't have a real job because I'm a pony and the pony dissection labs and all. But Look at every that. time I mow, I got a dad dolly, which I could turn into the dad store for cookies and stuff. So pretty soon I just mowed the lawn to death. Jesus. But then finally came the fateful day. Left home alone and with nothing else to do, I finished reading the phone book and decided to try reading receipts instead. Mm. It took me a little while to realize it, but dad dollars had major inflation. One dad dollar bought me stuff that cost like 30 cents or less. It was friggin' ridiculous. Hmm, okay How then. How long? How long what? How long has pocket lint had low market value? Uh, I've been misinvesting my entire future. Uh, I don't know, since forever? Since forever? Oh, why, why pocket lint? That box upstairs is worthless. I can't believe it. I'm totally bankrupt. I'm gonna hurl myself off the roof. Oh. Talk me out of it, LaFonda. Okay, don't go hurl yourself off a roof. Gosh, why you gotta be so dramatic? Because <sighs> my life is boring. What else am I gonna make a big deal about? Seriously, it's like this or my whole afternoon is just over. That, oh. Oh, hi. At nice. last, Fat Who Lived. I found your domicile and now. LaFonda, LaFonda, help. I, I think the government finally found me. It's just how I always pictured them. You're a talking blue Pegasus. A small one too. Yeah, I don't know if I'd really white. call her small. Unless, I mean, well, they usually have more inspiring frames. Yeah, no, there we I, go. <laughs> I'm, um, no, I'm I'm a, a lawn ornament, a talking lawn I'm ornament. Again. Hey, I'm very advanced. You being robbed over there? <laughs> what the help? She ain't got no worse stealing. She, she really doesn't. Only pocket lint oh. and a plastic body without any interesting organs to look at. This is the home of the bat who lived. Uh, oh. I guess. Yes. Yeah, that's my stupid dad. Oh! <laughs> well, your dad's not home, is he? No, I'm a big girl and I can watch myself. I have oh. been doing it since I was very little and I'm very good at it now. Now, mm. now, nonsense! Daddy's little girl needs a babysitter. Oh. There we are, much more comfortable. This is a but sudden change of tone and, and scenery. On, maybe we can go for a swim. Lovely lighting, Does though, I will give like you that. Fun? Uh, well, I guess so. I, I mean, like, I've never really been swimming. Is, is it very hard to learn? No! Aww. I'm going to lower you into the acid. You mean, uh, uh, you're, you're not gonna dissect me? Not, not to give you ideas. Well, uh... Dissect you? No. 
that would no the acid and dissection are mutually incompatible oh gosh wow it, it doesn't mean <laughs> acid's not oh, bad thank goodness she, she, see i was really worried there oh man so, so you like you want to hang out or something i really like 20 questions oh are you ready okay i'm thinking of a thing Okay, now ask me a question. You don't get out much, do you? No, not at all, really. Nah. See, I can't really go out on account of uh, I am a pony and, and, and different and stuff, you know. So I Which think society really just, they, they sort of want to cut me open and, and look inside of me, I, I guess. Really? Yeah, I figure it's like, have you ever tried to look really far down your throat in the mirror? Ew. You know, I yes, have the exact same ew. problem with society. It's always trying to cross-examine my actions. Monkey's always asking why I don't have a nose and why I strap my teeth and how come I wear clown makeup, but this is the face of fear. I have the face of Rainbow Dash. Well, nice. <laughs> it's nice to meet you, Rainbow Dash. Yeah. My name is the Joker Mod. The so Joker Mod. wants to dissect you too, huh? Uh, you know, nobody ever wants to dissect you. I love this so much. She doesn't understand. I haven't stopped smiling I since I started it. It's so hard to find someone who truly relates to you. Yeah. Ship. So Ship hey, them! Uh, do you maybe want to go play a game or, or do something fun? Actually, you know, I think there's supposed to be a great karaoke bar a few blocks from here. Would you like to go? Uh, oh my gosh, I would love karaoke. I karaoke. don't even care what it is. <laughs> karaoke. Dash? Uh. Dash? Where are you? Don't don't hide. I have a sugar cube. Come out! Excuse me. Oh, hi. Okay, this is going to sound crazy. But have you seen a bright blue winged pony around here? Maybe more in lines for cookies. You can tell me. Don't hide her from me. She'll kill your lawn. Excuse oh, dear. me. Have we met before? Because my name is Boudica Stephanie Cadillac Washington. And my little girl LaFonda is always talking uh, about her yeah, little blue so. pony. Has you been talking to her? Or more importantly, has she been talking to you? Because she ain't supposed to be talking to no strangers. What? No. No, I don't. I don't know who that is. I'm looking for a bright blue pony. Bright blue. You can't miss her. She might choke on something if I don't find her. Uh, you ain't answer my question. I asked you if my daughter done talked to you. I haven't talked to your daughter. Have you seen a magic pony? Well, Is maybe she... I seen a pony. Oh what my god. What gonna do if I seen a pony? You gonna come back to my place and uh, search my room? I, what? Cause I've had a few <laughs> stallions in my bedroom. My little tenderoni. Uh, you like curvy women? This, this this conversation has taken a turn I was not prepared for. Yeah. Mama, did that man just say he's looking for his magic pony? Yes. LaFonda, ain't you got somewhere to be? You were just... I'm looking for her stallion. But, Mama, that monkey's a bat wizard. Well, it sounds okay. like they make a lot of money. No, not really. No, Where not at all. Where did you see the magic pony? In your backyard? She went off with some monkey in clown makeup and a graduation dress. Oh no! Um, somebody better explain this magic pony. They're doing thing. drugs. LaFonda, is you buying drugs? Yeah! Is this a drug deal right in my nose? Because it sounds like Puff the Magic Dragon. I have to go. <laughs> oh. It's okay. I'm just supposed to sing what's written on the screen? Yes, dear. It's very fun. And when you finish, the audience will applaud you. Oh god, there's dynamite. <laughs> okay, that's cool. I'm not very fast at reading, though. You know, I really like to read, but all I have are phone books. It's all right, sweetheart. We'll do a duet. Thrift books. So hashtag not sponsored. Okay. Nice and cheap. Ready? Free shipping in the U.S. over $10. I think that you're rather unique. Perhaps you're something new. And if you like to oblige, I like to get to know you. You seem fundamentally fun. I feel like being your friend. Let's see the big city sights and find how well we Sounds win. really familiar. Mind if I say Hold on. I'm smitten by your smile. I hope you like all my jokes and that you'll stay for a while. I get that your humor is grand. Ah, whatever. At least what I understand. It's, it's really your good. Passion it's rubs off. It's better than I planned. It's the start of something to break. It's really much profound. I'm glad we ventured a chance. It's frankly hard to expound. Do you think we both have a chance? Can we even get by? I know the odds are against. We'll so make cute. it if we try. Your hair's up oh, and scabbery Jesus. down. What I still look in That is serious. Let's trust and figure for life. I am your pony waifu. That makes my poor heart burst with glee. Please promise that it's true. That you will need to choose me. I am uh, your pony waifu. That's, have to admit, I've never felt oh, this way. Oh God, rat another poison. Creature before. I want you to know that even though you're a horse, I feel something inside me that I never realized was missing. 
Wow. That's, That's so amazing. cute. I mean, the whole thing. I've never Aww. been out of my house. And you're like only the third monkey I've ever talked to. I just, I don't know. I always feel anxious and unhappy. But out here in the fresh air, I feel like maybe things are pretty neat. Well, I hope you realize Jesus. this is just the start of an awesome night. Professor, they're so cute. Oh, that's weird. Oh, Miss Buzzy. Wow. Oh my god. That's so cute. Your pony waifu. I predict a future for us. Where have I heard We're gonna song? make it shine. Because I know oh, that God, it's yours. so familiar. And I know you're mine. I predict big things for us both, Rainbow Dash. Between you and I, whatever else happens doesn't dad. matter. We'll have each other. Whatever, it's freaking cool. adorable. I mean, my dad says that all the time, but coming from someone who's not my dad, you know, that just makes me feel really special. You know, I've always hated your father. Yeah, I, I know. Did. My dad sucks. <laughs> God, we still have like nearly ten minutes of this left. Man. Oh. Where have you two been? Ah, you, you see. We were here. When I arrive at a kidnapping scene, I expect to see a victim. The villain and a vat of boiling acid. But look at this. What is this? This acid isn't even lukewarm. It's room temperature. Oh. Not sure. I thought I set the vat to a simmer. You turned it off. And not even so much as a ransom note. You see, these and details you, are very lady, important. What are you doing dressed like like that? Like well, Harley I Quinn? Got, um, one of yeah, the greatest well, villains we, ever. We got, um... I had some wheat beer. That was pretty cool. Oh, well, that's a relief. You're not allowed to have beer. Why? We are going beer home. Beer tastes pretty nasty. I feel you like that's a reason. You are a bad villain. You should be ashamed. You are not allowed to kidnap my daughter again. <laughs> what do you mean he's a nice guy? Are you insane? No. I, I don't know. But we sang a song together, and he didn't dissect me or anything. And I don't see what's so wrong about dating the Joker more, because he promised he'd be nice, and how come I can never leave the house? I, I didn't get dissected all day, but you said I would get dissected. Oh my god, I cannot believe what I am hearing. I am the bat who lived. The bat who lived. I know a thing or two about crime. Okay. And the only reason you didn't get dissected uh, why is because... Why not? I hate it here. I'm so bored and I don't have any friends. And all you do is hug me and, and, and bathe me. Ew. And I'm so lonely. And then I meet someone else and you... Dash, you listen to me. I am your father. You're not my real dad. You're not my real dad. I'm a rebel. I, I don't even need a dad. I never want to speak to you again. <sighs> And then he said, I can't see him anymore. Can you believe that? Sure can't. I know, right? Oh my god, look at the What's background. What's so about this new man he owes, anyway? Oh, uh, well, he likes to laugh a lot, and, and and he's a total rebel, so he doesn't play by the rules, and um, he's really different than everyone else, so we have a lot in common. Aw, there's just well, so cute. Sure sounds great. I know. And look at La Fonda, oh, she's listening. I, 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 it's I so was nice. Actually, um, I've always wanted a friendship it, like that. Is it normal for a boyfriend to Sad. kill other monkeys? Oh, pff, that's just what men do, girl. Okay. They always kill folks to be disrespecting them. I told you about my man David, right? Yeah. He said he killed some fool last week for making fun of the rims on his car. They were all like, oh, hey, nice rim job. And David shot him. Wow. Or at least that's what he said he did anyway. Okay. <laughs> Phew. See, I was really worried it wasn't normal, but I wasn't going to say anything because I didn't know for sure. So I guess if other boyfriends do it, then it's okay and I won't bother him about it. I feel so much better knowing that. You. No, no, don't get angry. I'm here to make amends. I think you've done enough. Not only did you involve Dash in a horrible crime spree across the city, but now she's under the insane assumption that the government doesn't want to cut her into pieces. Okay, okay. now just... Hear me out. What if they don't? Yeah. 
What if all this isolation from society and keeping her entirely to yourself was unnecessary? True. Are you implying she'd be better off with researchers? Maybe just someone who knows about horses. Yeah. Or someone with money. Yes. Or even someone not traumatized by the neurosis by the death of his parents. There we go. I'm the bat who lived. Okay. The yeah. Joker Moy. Dad, you cannot drive him away. Can't you see that I'm in love? Aww, Dash, so cute. That is why I came here. You see, I've just filled a time activated device. Very soon now, you'll turn the entire world into ponies. For oh. making you normal and allowing us to live together. Oh my gosh. Well, okay then. Seriously? That's so romantic. What? <laughs> Excuse me, but the door was open, so I figured y'all must be home or robbed. Y'all got a second? Kinda busy here. Yes. Can't you see we're discussing true love? So cute. Oh, so there was a magical pony. Hello. And your daughter wasn't well, doing I'll be drugs. Your monkey's mama. Well, you hey, are. Hey, Fonda. What, mama? How come you didn't tell me you weren't crazy or buying drugs? I try and tell you, mama, but you ain't listen. Well, I guess I owe y'all an apology. Here, I baked y'all a pie. Ooh. Oh. Oh dear, baby Jesus. Now there's more of them. You got magic ponies what just coming out the yin yang. Is that like a bill you gotta pay for the city, or is that like a leak or something? You see, I told you, it took five minutes for you to figure out we could track down one element of harmony with the other five, but it took two weeks to convince you that Fluttershy was the element of kindness. Yeah, well, what's kind about her? Well, I'm not really much of anything noteworthy, but Aww. I take care of a lot of animals. And Wait, I... just it was rhetorical. Oh my gosh, I always knew I was a princess from another dimension, and one day my knights would find me. <laughs> what? You got fat. Yeah. Eating. Someone else had to say. A lot of sugar. Your tiny cubes. brains. She has lost her memories. <laughs> yeah. Again? Dash, do you know who we are? No. This is like the <laughs> seventh time. The seventh time. Okay. Oh, I gosh dang. Care. Let's just go home. God damn it. No, what does Dash no, do? You can't take Dash away from me. I need. I. I mean, she needs me. She'll be all alone. No, baby, you ain't gonna be alone. Budaka gonna be right here for you. B B Budaka. That's right, baby. You just come to me and I'll make all your problems. Look, if she's willing to make your pie, I, I, I don't, I, I don't see anything uh, wrong. Well, you think I'm some kind of prostitute or something? It's okay. You gonna make some money. It's all right. You ponies, uh, just take your little. All right, plan good. Everyone's go happy except for the I'll Joker part, but maybe he can come Gross. along. Just really we optimistic didn't need your here. your permission, but thank you. Come on, Rainbow Dash. Go, Joker Moore, jump! Go! Oh, and Fluttershy too, for the low. Oh. Well then. Wow. So Rainbow oh, Dash went what? home, leaving no. behind her adoptive friends and family without really a word of exposition or logical explanation, which is probably for the best because she never really did totally understand what the other ponies were talking about, but Twilight said lesson learned, so it probably won't happen again. The Joker Mort, though at first not sure what to do without any thumbs, eventually adapted and used his magic powers and mad genius to build an army of lifelike Robo Dash girlfriend servants. Nice. Although later on he tragically died of heavy metal poisoning. Oh. Under the very oh. strict supervision of Miss Boudica, my adoptive dad Harry eventually came to terms with the fact that it wasn't really organized crime that killed his parents. It was actually a girl monkey who was really sick, and Harry's dad spent the night with oh. her, and then he got really sick, and he didn't want to tell anyone though, because he thought he would get in trouble for some reason. And so he came home, and then Harry's mom got really sick too, but for some reason Harry didn't get sick. Oh, but, God. but anyway though, from then forward, Harry became a guidance counselor. Jesus and he traveled Christ. around the inner city giving lectures on the importance of disease awareness and stuff to kids. LaFonda got accepted into Banana College on a oh. banana scholarship, where she got a banana degree in Way to degree. go, LaFonda! She developed a special device for brushing teeth without the aid of hands, thanks in part to the inside of Dash complaining for hours about it, and she made millions in banana dollars. Mm. And finally, Rainbow Dash, best pony in two dimensions now, did her best to lose all that weight and earn her cutie mark back in her homeworld. And while she did eventually find out that the thing she was best at was racing, Dash never did figure out good dieting, so she was pretty much ruined for life Jesus. because she could never get light enough to fly, and she hated healthy pony food anyway. So, yeah, all that bad parenting did not really do Dash a whole lot of favors. But still, oh. Dash totally made like a zillion pony friends, which is pretty much infinity better than one friend who isn't even the same species and otherwise she did okay so at the end well okay then <laughs> best rainbow dash presents episode ever no wonder you guys are so excited <sighs> stretch that was 
awesome. Boys Hack Me was nice. Yeah, the animation is really cool. It was very clean and very well done. Oh my gosh, I am so fat. I'm like one of those rapper's girlfriends or something. Oh, Rainbow Dust, don't worry about it. You're a bit extra chubby. You're beautiful, girl. And just to let you know, I like big pots oh and I cannot lie. You have a pony stand in nine. Don't want a mare walks in with a itty bitty waist and a round thing in your face. You get sprung. <laughs> you see, this is why you're my boyfriend. This is freaking adorable. Oh, there's more. I think. I hope. Oh! <gasps> oh! <laughs> Poor Fleming. Oh! Oh! Okay, bye! Oh, no, Flesh, what? <laughs> what can I say? Um. Well, first off, uh. It, it was amazing, and I laughed a lot. I certainly didn't stop smiling. Um, the Joker Mort and Rainbow Dash Presents Rainbow Dash is like, greatest, best, unbelievably amazing and adorable ship ever. My grammar was all wrong there, but who cares? Um, God damn it, that was so cute! And freaking, uh, I, I'm, I'm glad that Harry and LaFonda's mom got together. I mean, he felt like I felt like he needed to get some closure there. And LaFonda, good for her. I mean, she's good for her. I bet, given how she grew up, going to college and getting a scholarship and doing that kind of success, it, it was probably pretty difficult. So I'm pretty proud of her. Uh, Rainbow Dash, kind of proud of her for trying to lose the weight and felt like she could have stuck with it. But whatever, I'm not gonna judge. And uh, it, this has happened before, so. See what Rainbow Dash does in their spare time whenever none of us are watching. Um, I'm stuck at that. I don't want anyone to answer that. So, I will end it here because this video is already more than 30 minutes long and all that good stuff. So, I will fly with you guys later.